Hey everybody, Hooker TV X, Common Sense. I'm gonna say some shit I haven't said ever. Ever. Subscribe, like, and comment, and share. I rebooted this channel to try and save the youth. It may be in a harsh way, but it's necessary. You can't put a kid in the corner no more. They'll turn around and blow your fucking head off with a Draco. You get what I'm saying? All that soft shit. Oh, okay, you don't gonna be on punishment. Punishment? This nigga just killed two people. You tell my goddamn punishment? He punishing you. And I do this for the situation that happened with my son to where he's doing 30 years in prison at the age of 16. No driver's license. No shot on his 21st birthday. Uh, no rental. He ain't rented nothing. He ain't nothing. So everything that we do and, and it's easy to us, his kids is never going to see that. All that nice shit is over. Support it. We got to save these kids, man. It don't matter if we only save one. At least we did something. We could go up there with our little one save, and guys are going to kick us right on through. And we're going to go hang out with everybody. Toast up and shit. It's not going to hurt. Let's get it going. Let's get it goddamn going. Every kid and youth deserves a shot at life. Thank y'all for y'all time. Hey everybody, Pick TV X Common Sense. Again, rest in peace to Twitch. But we got Columbus Short jumping out. And if you pay attention to what Columbus Short said, you will understand. And if you look at the facial expression, but not only that, look at the hat he has on. Blackball hat. What's blackball, Columbus? Is that when they shut you down for not following their rules? Yeah, that's it. Is it? That's it. And then he gonna do these. He did these um, cryptic, subliminal messages. Okay, so he said that you invest. He invested every single dime into investments and let me say this I, I i agree with columbus short i got them agree with him he got down said exactly what it was i'm glad you did that brother so if you getting all types of money throughout the years and and, and, and you and you custom to this type of living and then the next day, your account say zero. You know what happened with them Wall Street people, what they do. They jump out the goddamn window. They jump out the goddamn window and they, cause they don't know how to handle it. They don't know how to make it from zero. But people like us that's been around these streets, we, we know about uh, all too well about goddamn zero. And we know that zero don't mean jump off a goddamn bridge. It just means zero. It just means you gotta put in more work, try harder, do your shit. It don't mean go and goddamn right before Christmas, goddamn get the kids and your and your wife a Christmas present of a goddamn slug in the head. I'm sorry, man, I know it's blunt. But it's it's too time to be, it's not the time to be powder caking shit and, and making shit fluffy. Nah, man. That time is over, man. Of course, we sorry about what happened. That's just that seriously fucked up that he had to even do that. But this is the question. What from that time that he wasn't at that hotel, so let's say two days before he did what he did, 
What do you think was going on with him? Trying to make him do something else? Reaching out to him at three in the morning, saying, do you want to fix this or not? Do you want your money back? This is what you got to do. And Ellen, hold on, let me tell you about Ellen. You the most phoniest bitch in the goddamn world, Ellen. Yeah, talking to you, Ellen. All that dancing and laughing and joking, bitch, please. It's over. You wrote a whole goddamn book, little book about how much you love him. Why Anne Hayes didn't get that same respect? When you married to Anne Hayes? Hmm? Wasn't y'all together? And you barely spoke. You barely said anything about her. Then you gonna jump out. See, y'all can be fooled while y'all want to, man. She gotta play that role. Like, she concerned and care. This is her situation. And she know it. Fucking dirty bitch. Stand these motherfuckers up in here, man. What drove this brother? It ain't all because he had a zero account and investments like Columbus Short said. Pay his money. He said he would never do what he did. He said, but he know why he did it. If you ain't got nothing to show, nothing, what's the next step to take care of your family? You guessed it. Insurance policy. How happy, pleasant, nice this brother was. He got broke down. He got broke down, man. We need to start checking deeper into that, man. We can't just go off what these people are saying on these goddamn bogs and news stations and TMZ and... No, nah, man. Use your own mind, man. Put your own shit together. Become Sherlock Holmes in this bitch. And look through all that fake shit. Ellen. I'm glad you said that, Columbus Short, man. I'm glad you damn said it. He says she want he he want her to pay him his money. What does he mean by that? When, what was he meaning by that? And then when he was talking about investments, how would he even think to say that? That's what they do in Hollywood. Hey, baby, got a good idea for you. If you want to get on, on the ground level of this project here, yeah, we're gonna get you on the ground level. So you're gonna be the what you do? You gonna be CEO of it or what? The ground level. Yeah, we're going to, and see, and this is going to be the predict, predictions of the shit, and this is going to be what you're going to make on this, okay? This is, okay, so, this is going to be returned right back to you, immediately. Immediately. Man, come on, man. How many times, nigga, did we do that, hustlers? How many times did you flip your baby mom taxes, or your girlfriend taxes, or whoever goddamn taxes? And you make it sound so good, don't you? Two, three weeks go by, ain't shit. Now she, what happened to the money? Man, shit, police came last night. Yeah, I didn't want to tell you, I didn't want to get you involved in this shit. I didn't want to get you involved in this shit, but don't worry, we got we got a safe net on them trip body. Two to three months go by. Shit, man, that cracked everything. I ain't got shit, child, I don't know what the goddamn do. Same shit in Hollywood. Same shit. Yeah, we got a big project going on, baby. And I, I, I'm thinking about you to be on the top of this here. So so, so what I need to do to put in, how much you got? Oh, I got, I got about 10 million or something. I got about 10 million. Okay, perfect. We just need nine. That's all we need is nine. We get this thing rolling and we get you back out 18. Don't worry about it. When they start talking that slick pimp shit and preacher shit, go the other goddamn way. Don't believe it. 
don't believe the hype. Yeah. It's, a, it's all a hustle, a scam, man. And you sitting there going to the, okay, now I'm going to drop all this in here so we're going to make it get your cashiers or how you want it. Because you know I can't, I, I can't cash app it. It's too much, they say it. Okay. Why, why am I writing it in your name? I can't just put it in the uh, company's name. No, no, you can't do it that way because I got to present it to them. I hope y'all get what I'm saying. Rest in peace, Twitch. Rest in peace. And salute. Let me show it. How many people died that you thought was happy and rich and instead they took their life? Research. There's too much to talk about. You'll need a whole five hours to, to speak on that. Do the research and look at the people that you least expected. Why would they do that to themselves? So? There's more to it. Common sense.